Welcome back, Wind Wakers, to The Legend of Zelda, The Wind Waker HD. I'm Scott, and you're at the Scott Spot channel. Okay, here we are back at Ganon's Tower, and this might be the final episode. If I decide to continue past the Puppet Ganon battle, uh, it will be. And I think that's what I'm going to do, so welcome to the finale of The Wind Waker HD. Thanks so much for accompanying me all the way through this. I mean, this is... After The Last of Us, this is my next series that I started, which I didn't start long after The Last of Us, so this has been a long time coming. Gotta go up all these stairs. Reminds me of uh, Super Mario 64, the endless stairs. Um, so anyway, like I said, this is I have full rupees, full fairies, pretty much 99 of everything. Um, I'm not too worried about uh, my hearts right now because I know that I'll be able to get more in just a second. So anyway, without further ado, let's continue. And we get to skip the cutscene, luckily. Uh, I, I might insert it before this, though. Alright, so let's see here. I think, if I remember correctly, you have to use the boomerang here? Use my gyroscope. Yeah, that seems right. I love this boss battle, actually. It has, like, um, cool music. Alright, looks like I broke uh, a couple of the strings. You would think the red one would be the main one I need to cut, but... Man, I hit him in a weird order that time, didn't I? Oh, jeez. Gotta be careful here. One more? Okay, that just leaves... what? The... How do I get him? Do I need to, like, shoot this thing? Oh, the tail thing is being cut. Alright, so... You have to shoot the blue orb with a light arrow in order for this to to damage them. Yeah, that's how you hurt them. Looks like Keith came down to fight. Alright, and then I think you just repeat the process. Do I even need uh, to kill the tail thing? Jeez, does Keith do that, yeah? Oh wow, wouldn't that have been awesome if I'd actually hit that? Get away. These are so annoying. Alright, I'm not even going to bother trying to hit the tail this way, because it's just going to end a disaster. Wow, I somehow already cut some of the cords. Jeez, that's impressive. I'm glad that the boomerang doesn't stop by hitting... Uh, jeez, look at it go. Doesn't stop by hitting uh, fin or Puppet Ganon's body. Got it. That was awesome. Is he gonna do the whole spinning move again? Whoa! I'm tempted to try to <laughs> hit it in the air, but I know it's just gonna take forever. No point in showing off those mad skills. It's interesting that they make this Ganondorf's pick form. Like, who knew the, that he had this power? I guess Ganondorf probably has all kinds of crazy powers. Round and round he goes. Who would have thought that the boomerang would be the weapon to go for here? Can I hit it now? Jeez, close. Ow. Alright, let's just get the tail thing then. There it goes. Move around. Awesome. Wow, that wasn't too bad, was it? Is that all you got, Ganon? Holy shit. Yeah, I really love the fake out it does there. Um, I love the, the boss battle music for this one too. So, he climbs up and then drops down. But, I was lucky and he dropped down like right in front of me. Um, so, what was I saying before he did that? Oh, was it just me? I know the music has been slightly touched up, but the music for that fake out victory theme seemed to play be a lot different because I remember it being very similar to the original theme this time it wasn't all right now I need to go this way wow he tried to land on me can I even get around back there 
Nope. I should try to stay more in the middle. Yeah, I can definitely tell a distinct difference in the Phantom Ganon music from the original. Or Puppet Ganon from the original. Get out of here, Keith. Oh, shit. He definitely moved in on me that time. <laughs> more Keith. So just make sure you look up whenever he's about to fall. I do like the new music on, they used here though. And I can't even get back there to attack him. I do, and they did a nice job with the graphics on the reflection there. Oh, I didn't even think to use the reflection to see where he was above you. <laughs> Shit. Damn it, he's all the way around there again. Seems like the keys come out like every single time, too. Alright, I'm just gonna ignore the keys this time. Yeah, just get around behind to where the tail is. Alright, so is that the second or the third time? I thought it was the third, but maybe I miscounted. Oh jeez. Yeah, I bet that's exactly what you're supposed to do, is use the reflection. I forgot all about that. How do you like that? Who thought of a pig spider puppet, by the way? Wow, and now we got this guy. So I think uh, the method here is that stuns him for a second, which isn't really enough to hurt him. You can also spin attack. Wow, I really didn't expect him to veer away from me that badly. Come on, let's try this again. So a spin attack stuns him for several seconds. Um, so if you can wait for him to come towards you and then spin attack, that will stun him. However, you have to be careful because if you charge up the hurricane spin, then uh, you'll be stunned for too long. So instead of that, I'm going to move around and just try to hit him that way. Wow, a fucking, a fucking morph got in the way of my light arrow. I think that would have been dead on too. Oh shit. See, it takes precision timing. Oh, jeez. Oh, too high. Uh, shit. Oh, got him. Got you, bitch. Is this supposed to be like... This reminds me of the Moldorm fight, actually. Um, in Link to the Past. Oh, man, missed again. Shit. Oh, wow, I'm actually about, almost about to die. It takes longer for the light arrows to travel than you would think. Oh, jeez. Oh, man, I just barely missed. Okay, I need more magic. There's got to be magic in here somewhere, right? Who put Morse in here, by the way? Oh, shit. Uh. Wait, did he really smash all the pots? Okay, so what am I supposed to do then? I guess I can kill the Morse? I think. I'm not sure I've ever run out of magic in this battle. What if I do this? Surely some of them have to have magic, right? Yeah, I'm really at a loss. Is there another way to hurt him? Maybe those pots up there? Shit. Surely you don't automatically lose the battle. And why did he attack me, like, non-stop there? Come on. Jeez. No, no, no. Alright, there goes the pots. Oh my god, I can't even get up there. Can I hit that pot? No. 
Maybe I can hit it with my sword. That's gotta be the only way. Okay. Oh, I actually got him. No, it doesn't do anything. What the hell am I supposed to do then? Um, I have no way to restore my magic. Um... If the normal slice doesn't work, I don't know what else would. Can I uh, get in this pot or something? What if I get in the pot and it recharges other pots? That didn't seem to do anything. I can't believe he destroyed all the other pots though. Can I like strike his face over and over? Come on. That seemed to like not do anything. Alright, um, hold on, I gotta look this up, I guess. Alright, let's try something. Uh, I read online that you could use a hookshot. Shit, this guy needs to get out of my way. Damn. Are you freaking kidding me? Go away! Why is he, like, freaking... Sometimes he stays away from you, and sometimes he's just, like, relentlessly goes after you. Um... Uh, So what did that do me? Nothing, I don't think. Oh, maybe the... Oh, I know, you're supposed to use the fucking... The hook shot to the pots, right? Come on. Okay, I got up. There's no pots over here. Why did I think that would work? There's pots over there, though. Get out of here, Morse. I'm glad you can move around in this version. I can't imagine how trying this had to have been originally. All right, here's one pot up here. Arrows. Why would I free... I guess it's true that I might need arrows. All right, let's try over there. <laughs> Man, this is crazy. This has never happened to me in this fight. I shouldn't have wasted those arrows in the first place. Okay, there's one magic thing. And more arrows. All right, well, there's one more platform with pots, so I guess I need to make this one count. Maybe I should stun him first. Probably a good idea. Jeez. Why didn't that work? Oh my god, I'm about to have to use another fairy. Uh. <laughs> oh shit. I've never had this much trouble with this fight. Jeez. Alright, alright. Come on. Oh, I still missed. Come on. Oh, one of them did drop magic. Okay, so that's... You would just think they would drop it more often, I guess. Alright, in that case, I'm not so worried anymore. Jeez, that was crazy though, wasn't it? Oh, shit. Oh, man. Fuck. Oh my god, come on! He's just wrecking my shit, honestly. Quit circling around me, jeez. Mm. Okay, I need more magic again. <laughs> Bye! <laughs> well... People say they want Zelda to be harder. I never had this much problem with this fight, I swear. I'm about to have to use my third fairy. Well, I'm sorry I freaking wrecked this, guys. <laughs> oh, I got him. There's still one more, though, I'm sure. Probably it's gonna go nuts now. It's so hard not to aim too high. I guess I'm just gonna have to get lucky. Ugh. Oh, I did get lucky. Nice. I forgot that he speeds up.
<laughs> yes, surely you are the hero of time, reborn. So was that him or not? Your time has come. Come now. Stand before me. Why would I do what he says? I like the cloak drake from Zelda. Yeah, so that wasn't it, I guess. So can I go backwards or not? The answer seems to be no. Alright, so that was fun, wasn't it? I guess now we begin our ascent of the tower. Um. Okay, so just jump on and you climb it like a rope. There's no point in swinging anywhere with it. Hold on, let me change the camera angle. Oh, this is the only angle you can do. That's cr crappy. This would have been a cool ca uh, place to be able to change the camera. It's a long-ass string, though. <laughs> Too bad you couldn't have done this at all during during the Puppet Ganon fight. Keep climbing, Link. It's a silent room, isn't it? And we made it. Wow. <laughs> I cannot believe that. Uh, hold up for a second while I recline that shit. Okay, here we are. See, last time I thought I was climbing up to a solid edge, not the top of this pole. I, I just don't even. I don't even. Wow. Alright, let's try this again. Can you imagine how strong Link's upper body must be? Okay, this time I'm just going to side jump to make sure I get to safe ground. Uh, how strong Link's upper body must be to be able to climb that long of a rope? I mean, that's insane. He doesn't even use his legs at all. Alright, so now what? Uh, I think I need to use... Oh, I need to use my grappling hook. Thank God for that. Too far. Okay. Please don't fall, Link. Please don't fall. Got it. Now I'll climb up again. I wonder... Mm, I was about to say it would be cool if Link got a different color tunic, but never mind. Because that would just be like the four sorts. There's more pots over there. See if there's anything of value in there. It's such a quiet room. It's almost eerie. I'm sure that's the attendant effect. Got some magic. Lots of magic. I'm sure there would have been some hearts in here if, uh... We were playing on not hero mode. I guess I should say regular mode. Keep climbing. This is a tall fucking chamber. Up we go. Side jump to prevent any more accidents. Oh, there's another warp jar over there. And there's pots around the edge of this. Alright, that goes... Oh, I thought I was going to fall for a second there. Why is there one random pot here? Oh, it's a fairy. Uh, let's bottle that shit. Oh, come here. I was about to say. Alright, so there's a fairy there. I wonder if there will be any others, because I uh, used three in that freaking boss battle. Wow, I mean, that freaking um, snake moldorm puppet ganon thing was just a travesty. I'm sorry about that lack of showmanship there. Any other pots around the edge of the room? I guess they put that one pot there since it was, um, it had, what you call? oh, there's another pot here, or another fairy. Come here. I mean, that's there were, there was one more though, huh? Let's kill that one. More magic. Actually, let's go ahead and burn this thing. I thought it wasn't going to work for a second. And now we have easy access to get back up here, should we need to. And? Yeah. So, this is the point of no return, Wind Wakers. Um, through that door is um, the final battle. And the final boss and the ending and all that stuff. So, I'm going to cut this off here and save real quick. And then I'm going to... When I start back in Gan's Tower, I'm going to make sure I have one more fairy and I'm back up to full health before I restart the next video. Real quick, um, before you continue through there, make sure you have made a copy of your save file. 
because I believe, I'm not positive about this, but I think you might not be able to continue your save file if you don't have a copy of it, because it saves over it when the game ends and then you can't play it anymore. Um, it could also be the fact that it asks you to save over um, your current save file with the new game plus, which I'll talk more about later. But anyway, sorry for the fake out on this being the last episode. I didn't expect Puppet Ganon to be that much of a trial, but next time we'll do better. Thanks again, Windmakers. Okay, we'll finish the Wind Waker next time at the Scott Spot. <laughs>